what's going on y'all what it is so let's go ahead and slide on this topic and this video won't be that long by any stretch of the imagination i just wanted to come on here and talk about this situation that's going down with john amos now john amos is my favorite tv father that's why i felt propelled to do this video because at the end of the day he meant a lot to me growing up watching good times right so apparently John Amos's daughter Shannon Amos has come forth with allegations stating that her father was possibly violated by a caregiver right and so basically this took place after John was hospitalized in ICU last month now Shannon is not taking this lightly she is very serious about this particular situation and in fact she is prepared to fight this legally right so let me take the time to read to you all what they had to say about this situation so it says here, John Amos's daughter claims Elder A.B. after actor hospitalized in ICU. Good Time star and America's dad John Amos was left fighting for his life in the hospital after falling victim to Elder A.B. and possible financial crimes, according to his daughter. Shannon Amos just made the shocking announcement saying she got a distressing call from her dad last month who informed her he was in the hospital in Memphis. Shannon says she was able to get John on a quick FaceTime as she was out of the country before his pain became unbearable. Shannon says in the last few weeks the Amos family has learned the 83 year old had fallen victim to Elder AB in financial exploitation. She doesn't give any details as to who is involved only saying a caregiver or what exactly happened to Amos, but does know his home had been violated, stripped of anything valuable. She also says the family is working with the Colorado Borough of Investigations and Cops to get justice. In an attempt to help her dad's recovery and help bring those allegedly responsible to justice, Shannon set up a GoFundMe with a $500,000 goal. Shannon says the money will be used for John's care, legal fees, and aftercare. While many would say John's biggest role was James in Good Times, he also starred in Roots and was on the West Wing. We've reached out to Shannon for additional details. So far, no word back. Now, I did go to her Instagram page and basically she did post this today on her Instagram story and it says, Soul family, please keep my family in your thoughts and prayers. And then she also said we are going through a challenging time. Shannon also provided the link to the GoFundMe account she set up for her father and I definitely will be donating to support the cause. Now, if this situation turns out to be true, y'all, I hope that the caregiver involved who thought it was appropriate to take advantage of an 83 year old whose health is definitely on the decline suffers the maximum penalty allowed for this type of violation. Now I'm also waiting to hear what John's son KC has to say about the situation. I'm pretty sure that he's ticked off. He loves his father. They were always doing things together, going to games, doing TikToks together. And just the mere thought of someone, let alone a caregiver who decides to violate your loved ones, especially when they're old and defenseless is enough for you to go ahead and do what you gotta do and turn yourself in at the nearest police station with a smile on your face if you get where I'm coming from but anyway guys I want to hear from you drop down and let me know what you think about this whole entire situation don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and until next time peace